so it's Monday I'm trying to do my workout and obviously start this vlog but this little man is just constantly ruining it and going under my feet when I'm doing lunges and stuff well I can't actually believe I made it out of the house but at the moment I'm heading to Winfield house which is I think a part of US Embassy I may be wrong maybe I read it wrong uh, but I'm gonna be attending reception with Esther Lauder and the breast cancer campaign as you probably may know they are very big and supporting breast cancer research so yeah let's go oh my god this looks so grand so I'm just um, at the Winfield house and look at all the lights it looks stunning so this is the 25th anniversary of the breast uh, breast cancer campaign with Estelle Lauder <laughs> to do a quick run all my runs are really quick I'm not like the you know 10k runner or anything like that but I just genuinely believe a few times a week even if it's shorter it's better than nothing and obviously pushing the buggy it's much harder at least I feel like that anyway I decided yesterday that it'd be quite interesting to do like a month challenge uh, I'm gonna try to work as much as I can I'm gonna try to eat better I said no drinking having said that <laughs> I think I had a half of a glass of wine yesterday at the Estée Lauder event. So yeah, uh, I had a banana before the run and I want to stop, do some grocery shopping, you know, get things like beetroot and really healthy. I was going to follow a detox program, but then I said, do you know what, I've got a couple of travel plans and with all these events, it's just, you know, I did it in the past where I would basically just you know come to an event and have a glass of water and it's just not socially great at all I mean you know you don't have to have six glasses of champagne and you know eat all the canapes but I feel genuinely I want to take it looser and see if I can get you know decent enough results in one month and maybe I can then do a video and tell you what I did and if it did have any impact on how I look how I feel and everything so yeah I'm just almost finished with the workout then to the grocery store and then I'll decide if I'm gonna go uh, to this like Christmas press day for one PR agency that represents a lot of like leading fragrances it will be quite nice but looking at the weather do I want to go central on this gloomy day but then if I quickly have a shower wash my hair and get everything ready get Liam ready I may as well go and maybe chill you know be back home by 3 p.m. and then chill afterward but the thing is, when I say chill, I'm on my laptop trying to sort emails, trying to do blog posts, try to edit, it's never ending. Well, I'm gonna go now, do, finish, the, finish the workout, well, the run, and then I'll see you later. Another amazing goodie bag from Estée Lauder. Candle, Jo Malone candle. I love, love, love Jo Malone candles. Peony and Blush Suede, one of my favorite. And it's perfect for autumn, you know! I wasn't even planning vlogging at all because I want to have like a proper chill out day at home obviously I'm doing editing and stuff but I just first time tried the pancakes just from banana and egg and it's super delicious Liam's loving it because I told you yesterday I'm really trying to go healthy so yeah we're gonna dig in and you don't need anything or at least I think Rio just came with this delivery so let's have a look I said I was not gonna vlog but this military coat. I actually thought it would be much warmer, but this is quite nice for this weather. From Joseph Ripkop. Love the detailing here. 
guys so today's first day i promise i will be vlogging more than yesterday i just needed like one of those days let me close the street actually um i just needed one of those days where i'm kind of gonna do my admin spend some time with liam do things like emails a bit of editing but also kind of relaxing because I feel like if I don't have at least like one or two of those days, it's quite hard for me. It's just, Liam keeps waking up really early in the morning and I have pretty much zero help apart from when I have like meetings or if I would be on a job. So my babysitter would take him, but then and we're just going for a walk now, just kind of locally. I need to go to post office, uh, send some of the depot stuff I sent. Uh, I actually, hopefully you can hear me, it's quite noisy now. Um, but yeah, I am selling a lot of stuff on depot because it, it really is time just to clear the whole flat really. I've got just so much stuff. Um, but I just, I'm like, I mentioned it already, I just find it so difficult to decide what to sell and what not. Uh, but yeah, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do now. And tonight, hopefully I got it wrong, I should be going to an event with Lulu Guinness. So it should be good. And tomorrow, I, I think I have only one meeting, but I still have to finish editing the vlog from last week. And obviously, keep going, keep going. I got quiet on Instagram because, like today, Yesterday, I just didn't get the timing right. And do you know what, like when Liam is like that and he's up so early, I can't be even bothered to be putting a picture on Instagram. So, just stopped to get um, healthy juice. I think this is apple, kale, lemon, and cucumber. Mmm. So good. Mmm. So, you know, I've been saying that I want to do like a really healthy month, well, as healthy as possible. I think I'm on a day four and it's going really well. Uh, I think I'm definitely more hungry, but it's just purely recently I've been eating anything I wanted. Like literally, if I wanted chocolate, I went for chocolate, pretty much glass of wine every night. And I think when you switch and you stop eating excessive amounts of white bread and things like that, um, you can feel it. Um, and especially like when you wake up so early in the morning, like today, I woke up absolutely starving. And if you think about it, by six o'clock, you are already two hours in your day. So I had to have my breakfast. I think I had two eggs with a lot of like spinach leaves and a little bit of halloumi for breakfast maybe around seven so this would be this would be my snack and yesterday I was making a lot of the um, pancakes but just from banana and uh, egg and they are so delicious I don't, I don't know why I've never tried it like I think somebody somebody I know once said on Facebook it's disgusting so I was like okay but it, actually it is really nice so I'm gonna be making and it's obviously a much healthier option of a pancake as well and if you add some fruit maybe some honey it can be like one of those like power snacks or power breakfast but you know I prefer savory so yeah I think I just had a moment maybe just to balance the level of sugar in my blood yesterday so yeah we're just now off to Florchu Plain maybe I'll stop for a coffee and then see this is new. I haven't been here yet. This is on East Dulwich North Cross Road. Let's have a look. Oh my gosh, this is very tempting, especially on a healthy month, right? <laughs> Looks really good. But... Yeah, that's, that's really good. I'm at Gales. I picked up this very healthy looking salad or whatever. I don't know what you would you call it and soya latte. 
Yeah. I'm starving, so let's dig in. Just checking my emails as well, so I better go home so I can start the response, to be honest. But I'm um, first comes first, lunch is here. Just came, or more like a courier, and Liam got sent new boots. Let's open it. Liam, ku pojď se podívat. Pojď se podívat na nové boty. Liemku, tvoje nové boty, hele. Co na ně říkáš? Jaké jsou? Jsou suprácké. I'm just waiting when he... These are the snazziest slippers ever. Like rose gold, metallic and so comfy. I just got sent these today. Uh, whilst Liam got the boots and I love them. I'm so ready. <laughs> ready for whatever. I'm ready for cozy evenings at home. I don't think I'm gonna do anything on my eyes because I'm honestly so knackered today. The 4 a.m. alarm. Alias Liam killed me. So I keep like when I'm tired, I keep like doing this to my eyes and touching it and rubbing it. But I think what's this to cover that? Um, I'm gonna use this lipstick. It's Tom Ford from the Boys Range. Uh, and it's number 46 Colin and I really like it. Mm, it's kind of like a nice nude, not very neutral kind of, but a little bit like darker tone, not like a vanilla kind of like really beigey, but you know what I mean. Well, I hope you do. It's really nice, yeah. So this is pretty much what I'm gonna wear and I need to dye my roots. Right, so I'm just at Covent Garden and I'm heading to the Little Givers event I mentioned. It's quite difficult to walk, people looking weird at me <laughs> whilst I'm vlogging. I'm just waiting for somebody to shout again. But basically she worked with Vaseline in the past and she designed the boxes, well they're not called boxes, the little tins for Vaseline. So I think they're launching the new collection, so it should be good in their store obviously nice drinks I'm not gonna try to drink or eat anything relatively bad because I'm sticking to being healthy this month to trying to minimize it unless I really have to like going to the wedding and Covent Garden is so busy it must be the weather as well and the fact it's Thursday yeah, so let's go I'm almost there so you think you were right Bring it on, prove me wrong Go put up a fight mm -hmm. The way I do, way I do will knock you down You know there's an ocean between us Don't, don't cry about it Don't, don't cry about it You want me to take you in my trust Friday. It's around 8 o'clock and I'm just getting ready uh, for a meeting which I have later. You probably hear Liam chatting in the background. He's playing with, what is it? Aftershave. Basically whilst I was showering, well, whilst I was washing my hair, he basically goes around the bathroom and anything he can grab he wants to play with. If you have a child you know. But um, the reason obviously why I'm talking to you like this with my wet hair is I wanted to tell you and show you a product I just used. It's this um, La Roche Posay Extra Gentle uh, Gel Shampoo and it's meant to really soothe your scalp. So basically in the last few years I've always had like a, a really really sensitive scalp tendency for flakiness and I had to change shampoos quite regularly so even if I found a shampoo that, that suits my uh, skin 
and after a while it would just stop working. Uh, so now for a long time I've been using um, the blue kind of range Kerastase, I can't remember from the top of my head uh, what is it called. And my scalp recently got really really bad to the sense like it's so itchy. Um, and I know I've tried so many shampoos, so if you have any recommendations, something that you that really worked for you, I'm, I'm happy to try. But anyway, somebody told me that it's quite good to put a coconut oil and massage it in your scalp, but obviously it will get your hair really oily. So I just did it this morning because I'm, I was like, I have to do something about this. Um, and then I washed it twice with this new shampoo and I'll actually know how I get on but at the moment it feels good but it's hard to say, it's hard to tell so yeah I better get going get ready that was my laptop oops <laughs> So these are the shoes I'm wearing today, again, I've been wearing them a lot in my Aspinall bag, I just had a meeting with Aspinall, so yeah, representing the brand. So I just finished my meeting, it went really well, and uh, I'm just waiting for the babysitter to bring me in back, and I'm going to probably look around Chelsea, maybe meet my friend Kelly, if she's going to be able to make it, I'll go maybe to Zara, because I absolutely love the Zara here, maybe Club Monaco. Go around some shops and maybe if i feel like it i may go to the Saatchi gallery it's like one of my favorite galleries in london so yeah let's go and enjoy the day I think this is one of the nicest Zara's ever. She doesn't want to be in the vlog and that's Alexandra. She's having her croissant. Are you gonna wave Alexandra? Are you gonna wave at the camera? Or give a high five. High five! Yay. And there's Liam. Doesn't want to sit in the chair. <laughs> so lovely here. Somebody is tired. So this pink on me Love these shops here at Chelsea. Like all the art places and all the furniture shops and vintage shops and antiques. It's just beautiful. Right, so we just got back home and I think Liam is sleepy so I put him down for another nap let's see how that's gonna go and although I would like to go and nap as well I've got so much to do um, I definitely have to finish the editing the vlog from the last week so that's what, what I'm gonna do now uh, make myself a cup of tea with some soya milk put on a candle and yeah I, I can't do anything else than that really uh, my friend invited me for like a girls night in nice dinner at her place but unfortunately as much as i would love to go i need to spend some time at home and just really get on with work and spend time with my family as well so yeah i'll check in with you maybe still today and if not today then tomorrow i Thing. what am I doing tomorrow yeah I have to go and shoot quite early uh, so yeah another reason why not to kind of do much this evening so it's Friday night and Liam is reading so be sure Liam cool he's so good with his books honest hello Liam Liam slept until six this morning such a good boy hey <laughs> I'm gonna make spinach omelettes for breakfast, just gonna cut spinach, two eggs, mix it all together and fry it. I'm really coming out of ideas for healthy, savoury breakfast. <laughs> Here we go, ta-da! And it's done. I just need to make one for my husband. It's not gonna kill him to eat healthy, but he's gonna have some toast with his. I'm not. 
Hey guys! Oh, that's light. So today is gonna be family day, but I also wanna do some DIY. I've got this table which I've been planning to paint for many years. So my husband's getting the sander for me. I'm gonna go downstairs to the garage and sand it. <laughs> I took the um, this out already and it's really nice like ornamental I've had it many years I think I bought it from somebody I've got a really nice kind of matching chair and I think I want to both um, paint them white because I want to change the living room a little bit and I think if I'm not going to do it now I'm definitely not going to be doing it in the winter so yeah that's going to be the job for the result of my fantastic sanding me and making mess there again and we will have to paint it. I thought I was gonna finish everything today but basically we don't have a primer at home and my husband just didn't go and buy it. So we'll have to be done tomorrow and I was so excited to have a bath and there's something with the boiler so it's not working. Yeah, interesting Saturday. <laughs> DIYing and then not able to have even a bath. Liam is still asleep and so is my husband and I think my point is just because I can't I think on most days if I sometimes get an opportunity to actually sleep my body is so used to it, like waking up and like not sleep long especially since I had Liam so I just can't sleep so I'm really enjoy my coffee my friend's Emma vlog from Paris. I can actually link down her channel below so you can guys have a look. Um, I think she's one, one of my all-time favorite YouTubers. She's really good and she deserves so much more followers. Like the quality of what she does is unbelievable and it's fun. Yeah, it's just really really good. I love it. Anyway, and the plan for today is, um, oh yeah, just to go back yesterday, I was so shattered, like you can tell I don't really do DIY and although I thought I would start painting we didn't have the stuff so but it took a few hours actually to send it and obviously I was trying to do as much content as well and um, I posted a new article last night and uh, so I don't know when this vlog is gonna be up but you know there's always a link to my blog so you can have a look it's actually a little bit connected to the last vlog um, and more about my stay in Noble but more from a review perspective what I actually thought of it um, what they need what I think they need to improve and what was actually really good I do love these kind of calls and I do love to work with hotels as well um, it's just like gives a nice mixture to what I do uh, okay and today I'm gonna meet my friend Tasneem and uh, we're gonna shoot for the blog uh, have a quick coffee and yeah, then probably start painting. Hopefully we can source the, the stuff we need today and do more work on the blog. So I'm trying to use weekends to do as much as I can, whether that is for the blog and for you know for the stuff that needs to be done at home. I'm just thinking what are these? I think it's actually scratch from Liam or something because I've got a few of them and they're really really random unless I'm coming down with some disease <laughs> anyway oh my god this is so delicious guys I can't even cope anyway um, we're off to Ireland next week so I'm just thinking because I really want to do a travel vlog we're going there for a wedding I'm just thinking how I'm gonna do it uh, whether I'm gonna do maybe one or two daily vlogs and then you know do like a travel vlog uh, but also need to check my diary you know depending on what I have on I think on Monday I'm meeting with clinic but it's gonna be shortage house so I can't again film there and you know you, you can't really film in a meeting you know you just talk and that's it I probably wouldn't <laughs> put what we talk about either um, on here but I'm just thinking if I have any events yeah, I need to decide. Um, I'm definitely gonna film a video before I go to Ireland, more like sit down and I and I think it's gonna be beauty. I'm not gonna tell you much more. 
and yeah and then if we go to Ireland again I'm quite excited you will love my dress for better than the first footage from this morning and I need to choose what I'm actually shooting I'm only gonna do two outfits today because on Tuesday I'm meeting a photographer that uh, kindly messaged me if we could shoot together she found me on Instagram so yeah um, I don't really have to um, work too hard today so two outfits only today and I want to have it done come back and then work on the little table I showed yesterday so yeah that's the plan not very exciting nothing really glamorous it's just work <laughs> blog and then DIY that's the new ever guys new ever so I'm now at London Bridge Cafe are waiting for this name who's running late uh, and I just put this berry boss just to start the day healthy. It's got apple, blackcurrant, carrot, blueberry, blackberry, chicory root and beetroot. So I'm gonna drink that. I just messaged her saying I'm gonna put her in my, in the box of, with all my friends that are always coming late. She didn't like that. But if you follow my blogs, you know who she is. Anyway, um, I said to her, I'm gonna start to do that thing we do with one of our friends, Caroline. Uh, you know when we mean, for example, to be somewhere at 10, we tell her like 9.30 so she's actually rushing and actually turns up at 10 but then we turn up at 10 so nobody is really late you just have to trick them a little bit, that's, that, that's so much time on my hands I'm gonna quickly show you what I'm wearing while sitting so I've got this um, uh, Armani exchange coat, this is from H&M and then I'm wearing a Saint Laurent bag and this is a skirt from Zara which is the first time I'm wearing it I got it on sale and like I think I paid maybe like seven pounds and it's actually really nice because I've had a um, kind of healthy week I can already feel it like on my tummy so I feel I felt like when I bought it it was quite tight so I was thinking to selling it or give it you know to some of my friends but actually I feel good in it now and it fits fine so I'm gonna keep it if she comes, do you think she looks guilty? Let's see the face. Is that a guilt face? Is that a guilt face? Oh my god, guys, look how they've changed copper. It changed from last week. This is amazing. I'm gonna give you a sneak in. Oh, I love that. This is only for Liam and my husband because I've been quite, well, I've been cheating, I mean not too much, but I've been cheating with food. Uh, so I had the broccoli instead with a bit of garlic, very, very simple and very clean. So yeah, uh, my husband and Liam, they're gonna have that like chicken, uh, chickpeas, some onions, tomatoes and some couscous. It's, it's really nice, I tasted it, so yeah. That's our Sunday, guys. Quite healthy as well. I'm just getting ready some fish for dinner. There's just garlic, pepper, a lot of pepper. I love a lot of pepper on my fish. Um, and I think it's like, a, it's caught. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna end this walk here because we're just probably gonna eat. I get Liam early and ready for bed. And yeah, uh, next week is obviously new week. I need to think about the vlogging, but we're off to Ireland. So I'll see you there, I guess. Bye! People talk and tell what you wanna hear now. But they are disappearing, never let you down, so.